Not everyone gives us a perfect back look in their review. And I am doing a, well you might be wondering why I'm doing a review on this, this old, old deck from the Illusionist. And that is because when I looked at my channel, the review was not there. I'm fairly certain I did it at some point. There is a review on the Saddle Master that you can check out. Um, might be a little more detailed than what I do for the Saddle Master this time around. But um, for some reason, it's not there. Anyways, so these are the Bicycle Masters from the uh, Illusionist. At the front of the box, it says Bicycle. It does say Masters under there, and then Masters Edition right back on the bottom. See a nice spade tip, very elegant. The other one is a Saddle Masters, it says Bicycle Top. Saddle Masters on the bottom as well as Masters Edition right back. And again, the pip, and you can see there's a bit of a saddle going on with the artwork. The side says UB500 Airflow Fitness and Made in USA. For the red and the blue, Ericus and Fitness Made in USA for the Saddle Masters. It's uh, obviously a newer version, slightly newer. US Point Guard Company, Cincinnati, Ohio, on one side on the red and the blue. United States Point Guard Company on the Saddle Masters. Top, they all say poker and they got the illusionist logo. And again, you can see some of these definitely got the older logo and this has a new logo. logo. They all got different logos, it's funny. Each one is different. Bottom, more indication that they're all different. Uh, they say bicycle poker 808 on these two. And Saddle Masters, which is actually from 2010, has just copyright or USB-C info. They all got reveals, Seven of Spades, Jack of Diamonds, and Free of spades. Again, all different. More indication that they're all different. Different colored seals. I'm not sure if originally they all had the same seals, but this one's got a red seal, this one's got a black one, and of course this one's got a black one. But this red and black, red and blue, and this one again, really sad look to it. And then we get to, well, the flaps is just trademark stuff on all of them. There is no ad card in these. Um, I imagine that there was an ad card, and I have it somewhere in my drawer of like free loan other ad cards. But I used to take them all out. Now I generally keep them in. Uh, but in this deck, you do get this. It's the Bicycle 808 Ghost Ace of Spades. I guess it works as a gaff card. Color change and change the Ace of Spades. It's nice. You do get the standard Jokers with blue backs and red backs. The Ace of Spades, really nice. The Bicycle Masters Edition, US Point Guard Company, Cincinnati, USA on the bottom. Nice big pip with an eagle in it, blue coloring, really majestic and whatnot, I like it. And I don't have the red one, but it's the same thing, just red instead of blue. These cards do appear to have an aristocrat stock and an Aircrest and Finnis. Well, actually, Airflow Finnis, but as far as I know, it's just a different name with the same thing, more or less. Could be slightly different Finnis, but it's basically the same thing. And it's kind of like a predecessor to the performance coding and magic Finnis, I would say. Um, oh yeah, I should show you this one quickly. This one, you do got the Wizards that card, old school. When they used to be good, before, it's before Madison, <laughs> when it was good. The back design, just the right of back, again, kind of faded here and there. Really big ass borders because they decided to make them like that, I don't know. If you look closely, you'll see the actual border line, but then they, looks like they sprayed black over the line. You do get a double backer as well. The Joker is pretty cool. It's this Grim Reaper type guy with his big uh, blade holding an hourglass. Time is almost up. Jay in the corner and the Joker on top, USB-C style. The other one's the same thing except the hourglass is replaced for free of diamonds reveal, which is pretty cool. Ace of Spades, again, basically the same as the other one except it's a Saddle Masters on the bottom. And it's gray and white. And then the court cards. Standard, like the other one, except again, they got a lot of saddles on the pips and everything. Same with the number cards. 
Uh, unfortunately, these got a lot of chipping from usage and whatnot. But it is what it is. <clears throat> Typical for a black deck with USB C. And again, the same kind of stock and finish, although this one does say Airquist and finish. Um, you know, it's handling pretty good for its age, aside from wear and tear issues. <laughs> and then these ones, they're handling okay too. Oops. Uh, I'm not going to worry about ranking the artwork or anything like that because it's just basically standard. And it's an older deck. And it's same for the handling. The handling is actually pretty good, but I'm not going to worry about it. I'm not going to worry about scoring anything. It's, it is what it is. You can still get these at a reasonable the website. They're like your standard bicycles, I guess. Um, at least last I checked, you can still get them. Correct me if I'm wrong. Saddle Masters, for sure you can get. If anyone wants a Saddle Masters, I do have one available. I'm always trying to sell that, so... If you look for decks, I might have it available. Anyways, that is that. Now, I, now this is on my channel. I will see you next time with more reviews.